In this kit you get five pieces. These two pieces are identical and these three pieces are identical. The long pieces go front to back and they're reversible. Uh, there's no front and back um, specifically. And then the short pieces do have a specific orientation and you can see that this uh, hump here will go to the passenger side because there's a raised rib in the rubber mat at the bottom of the console that that has to go over. So what you're going to do is interlock these pieces, um, lock them all the way down to the bottom, and we'll do the three side-to-side -side pieces. Again, make sure that this hump lines up with the passenger side. All three will be the same situation. And then you've got those together, and then let's put the long piece in there and interlock all these pieces together, line them up, push them down, everything will square up. You won't hurt the plastic, the plastic's sturdy but flexible. So I like to build it on a flat surface so you can get everything locked together and rigid. So next step is to flex it into the console and I'll do that in just Now we're going to install the organizer into the console. I recommend that this back bracket for the hanging tray gets removed. Just slide it to the right and rotate it out. Um, we'll take that out temporarily so that we can have enough room to get this organizer in a little bit easier. So I like to take the organizer and make sure that these are facing the passenger side, these little bumps, and kind of go down and rotate it into position. And everything is going to flex and that's okay. And then just kind of rotate it in once you get to the bottom. Once you get down under the, the hanging bracket pieces, it snaps into place pretty good and then just go through and do the little alignment step to make sure that everything's squared up make sure everything's pushed down and then you can take your um, bracket and uh, put it right side up put it back in its slots slide it to the left and it's back together